All right. Twist. Come to the end of a week. End of the week. That's right, life happening. Stay out of my way. Four, three, now single arm, right arm first, right, and change. Changing that bell right in the middle. Trust yourself, you can do this. In eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Keep my shell on this. Setting up for the Russian twist. Bring your right hand to the bell. Bring your left hand over. We twist. Here we go. Little pivot. Now notice the bell as it swings right along our wrist. You move with momentum. In four. Here's three. I want you to make this big. You do three twists and one chop. One, two, three, up and over. One, two, three. Drive the bell up. Swing it right by your hip. Good. One more here. One, two, three, and lift. What a great combination Woo! of cardio and strength. Bring your kettlebell oh right up by your side. We squat out and in. Down, now to the left. Let's do two more without the press. Now press your bell overhead, right in the middle. Push it up. Your bell is back, resting on your wrist. Use your legs. Keep your weight in the center. And as always, I'm going to do my yeah. modification on these exercises. Yes, last one. Right back to the twist. This time, your left hand comes on the form. Your right hand over. Ready? Twist left. Side and side. All the way through here. Woo! Let the We're not move. going around. Now, in four more. In three. We do three twists and one chop. Let's do it. One. Two. two Three and down. One, two, three and down. One, See, I two. I get this three. on. Get up there. Pull it down. Your last one. Two, three, and four. I just don't want to hit right my face. Squats. <laughs> Legs together. Bell back. Bring your hand to your hip. Squat out left and to the right. Down and in. Your hips are square. Working through with that power. Add the press right in the middle. All the way up. Extend and lift. Use your legs for help. This is not just about your upper body. Trust me. Down you have. Two more here. And one. Nice work. I love this exercise. It's called the halo. Bring your bell right to the center. Oh, yeah. Take your bell around your ear, right to left. Around. We did some of those. Such a great oh, exercise for the core and for the shoulders. Let's do four more here. Here's three, all the way up and over. Two more. Other direction, left, around, around. Woo! Your knees holding here. Let your hips do some work. Four more, perfect. Three, nice and easy. And two, bring your bell to your chest, lunge forward. Right leg, now left, lunging. Lead out with that foot and push back. We're going to combine the chop and the halo. In two, bring your bell to your hip, down, up, and over. One. Such a dynamic exercise. It works your entire body. Core, shoulders, legs. Two more here. Down and up. Around. Complete the exercise. Now, toes out. This is a standard exercise for kettlebells. It's called the squat to the rack. I want you to bring your bell right to your sternum. Your knuckles are down. Left hand right by your hip. Toes forward. Here we go. Down and up. Little pop with the bell. Bringing it right to your wrist. Nice and easy. You've got it. Four more here. Three. Send the bell down. We do two more. Add a press overhead. Down. Rack. Press. Perfect. Lower it down. Now let the bell move around your hand. You have two more times. Then we're going to add power with the hop. One more here. Amy and I will catch low. Here we go. Down and catch. 
Push. You got it. Lower. Catch low. All the power in the lower body. Just two more here. Little press. One more. Down and lift. All the way up. Now into swings. Bring your toes forward. And you notice I have an eight pound kettlebell. Another great exercise with the kettlebell. Squat and push it. Down and up. Not too heavy. Like the bell. But not too light either. Move right in front of you. Use your hips. Drive your heart rate up and accentuate. Woo! Right here. Come on, reach and push. Squeezing the glutes, you should sit back into your heels all the way. Now that you know it, give me eight more strong swings. Eight, lift, seven, and up. Six, lift, five, looking good. Here's four more here. Here's three. We're going to go right into rack and press on the other side. Nice. Last one. Land low. Let your bell swing. Very important that you let the momentum stop. Now, bring your bell into your left hand. Bring your right hand to your hip. We squat to the rack first in four, three, two. Here we go. Let's get it. Down and up. Let that bell move. Power in your legs. Notice that your legs do the work. This isn't about your arms. It's about power. Two more here. Add the press. Down, little wrap, little press. Perfect. Control in the body, letting that bell move around your wrist. Control, one more here. And then we add that powerful jump. Ready? Here we go. Down, little catch, little push. You have. Well, in my case, I just do a little light catch, hop. Little I'll push. do a hop. Two more, you're right there. Little catch, little push. Your last time, go. Down and lift. Press. Nice. Last set of swings. Roll your shoulders back, toes forward. You know the exercise. Ready? Let's do Let's it. Go. Swing back and lift. Hip thrust. That's why we went over it in the beginning. So now use it to your full advantage. As you swing, drive. Drive up through the heels. Press those hips forward. Let's do eight more times. Seven. Six. Where do we land? We land low. Here's four more here. Here's three. Here's two. Here's one. Land low, you guys. Nice and easy. Bringing it down. Perfect work. Bring your bell right to your chest. Step touch, right left. Holding here. What a great set with the kettlebell. Hopefully, you feel a little bit more calm about using this great piece of equipment. I wanted to introduce it to you in a short little segment. So don't be afraid. It will change your body. Trust me. Great job. Thank you, Amy. Woo! And... Hey everybody, Pedro here for PG's Continuing Journey Channel, and I just racked up Amy Dixon's Give Me More, Give Me 10 I should say, 6 10 minute workouts, the 6th one was the bonus kettlebell tone up, using my 8 pound kettlebell. Just put the camera here so you can see me, there we go. My eight pound kettlebell and 10 minutes of great circuit training in there. Cardio strength together. And we're coming to an end. I'm coming to an end of another week. Excuse my mess because I got a lot of laundry flow to do first thing in the morning. But um, another one of those, as, as another one of those weeks where, you know, for me, life is just, you know, People saying hi and excuse me like they don't want to be freaking bothered but you know I just keep my mind off of what I don't need, don't need to be thinking about right now no the past stays in the past but don't worry about the future here either I just want to get through today and I did get through today beautifully hopefully the scale will cooperate with me with me I'll keep you posted on what happens see us